darkness. So the light comes and eliminates the darkness. Jesus being the light of the world who comes to deliver us out of that darkness. Being that light that we may follow in the life, the, the path of, um, of light, which is in Christ Jesus. You know, sorry, um, don't mind me sharing the story. Yeah. Keep going, um, man. Thank you, Moses. When I was a little kid, you know, kids, you know, get up to mix and do some silly things sometimes. And uh, there was a bunch of us kids, and we used to hang down this creek. And in this creek, there's this massive uh, tunnel. It's a sewer tunnel. Um, I don't advise any kids to go venture in there, <laughs> but that's something that me and my friends did. We thought it was a fun thing to do. So we entered into the tunnel, going into the tunnel. But as we entered into the tunnel, we were in a single file and we were holding from hip to hip as we were entering and going in. And what seemed to be all fun and games, the people that we got into this tunnel, the fear and the anxiety started to creep over us because. At that moment in time, it was pitch black. And, um, but we wanted to continue this path and going forward. So we did. And we held on to each other. You know, I'm holding to the person in front of me, and that person holding to the person in front. And you got the leader at the front leading the way. And we march on. We're scared. And we continue. And all of a sudden, in the distance, we see a little flicker in the distance. And that was our aim. And that gave us a bit of hope. And we continued forward, aiming towards that flicker of light. And as we get got closer, the flicker of light became brighter and brighter. And as, we, as it became brighter and brighter, the fear and the anxiety slowly, slowly left us. And all of a sudden, we get to the end and we are the one with joy. So that's a little experience that I went through as a kid. And like I said, um, kids, if you feel like venturing and doing stuff, don't do that. <laughs> Not 